NASA doesn't want you to know they have the last dinosaur. Earlier this year in February, oh, Lucas Meyer was hiking the window trail in Texas. He loved hiking. However, today he found something incredible. In the early 1980s, NASA created facilities all over the United States. One of these facilities was built near the window trail in Texas. It was an observatory, or at least that's what NASA told the public. When Lucas was hiking, he always liked to wander off the trail. While hiking the trail, Mikkel saw a small hill which looked to have a great view. The view from the top of the hill was nice, however, something was not right. He was standing on a covered metal plate of some sort almost resembling a hatch he brushed off the top and sure enough he was standing on top of a small metal hatch the words zone c property of nasa stay out was engraved on the hatch without much trouble he managed to pop open the hatch below was a ladder leading down at least 100 feet his curiosity got the best of him and he ventured down luckily he had brought a flashlight with him at the bottom of the ladder was a tunnel leading towards another door the tunnel was cold and it looked as if no one had been down there for over 10 years he came to the door and saw it had something written on it it read, Carnivore Habitat, Restricted Personnel Only. The door was locked, but he was an experienced locksmith and was able to pick the lock. On the other side of the door was a massive room, 300 wide in each direction. There was a fenced walkway around the room. The walkway he was on was at the top of the room. The bottom must have been at least 100 feet below him. Interestingly enough, there were trees in the massive pit below, and the area was lit, presumably with ultraviolet light. Suddenly, he heard the trees and bushes below him rustling. Was there something down there, he thought. What he saw next nearly gave him a heart attack. The head of a T-Rex had 